Do we have to pay, uh, Todd, do we have to pay Elvis for that song now, or what? No, we don't have to pay that, okay. As a singer for the band Creed, our next guest has sold tens of millions of CDs in packed stadiums around the world. His first solo CD comes out later this year. Please welcome Scott Staff. <laughs> I know, uh, I know Elvis brought his out, but mine's bigger. Yeah. So, That's a gift. It's well, a gift for you. Well, awfully nice of you. You know, our, our producer over there is a big fan. He actually wants this, and I'm saying, no, it's, it was given to me, but maybe we can give him a guitar pick. Maybe that's you know, what we I can. may have one. Yeah, we'll try to yeah, get one later. That. Thank you for that. Awfully that. nice of you. How are you doing, man? I'm doing wonderful. So are you not, is Creed breaking up? Are you going to? No, 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 no. We, we, uh, we've been together 10 years. Yeah. Uh, I think January 15th was 10 years, and we all committed to 10 years together. Yeah. And uh, we're kind of taking a little hiatus and, and Going doing, solo for doing our own little thing. Scott's like a plus two handicap. <laughs> he, wants to be a, he wants to be a golfer. Right. And uh, Mark is producing and, and yeah. going to put out a solo album himself, I think. And yeah. So things are good. So you've been doing it 10 years. You've packed stadiums. Do you remember the, like, the smallest little club you've played in? Uh, yes. Uh, Gosh, I played in so many small clubs. That's that's um, gotta be tough playing in small clubs. It, it it's more intimate. Well, what, what but if, I, I was so driven, I didn't care. But there were, we played in clubs. There's like three people there. That's where that that's where yeah. the hard part gets. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> and uh, the thing is, is my my mentality was, I'm no different than twenty thousand. Give give those give three them, people the best show. The best you show need. I can get. Yeah. 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 And that's kind of how it grew. Yeah. Grew from there. So. Are you surprised at how well the band uh, did? Has it been doing it? Uh, it? It was. It blew my mind. I, yeah. mean, I mean, the the label, Wind Up Records, and Alan Meltzer, who owns the label, we were their first band, first yeah. signing. Yeah. And they just put the whole staff behind us and, and promoted us, and we went out on the road and played 500 shows in six years or some. No, no, 550 shows in six years. That's a lot of work, man. You yeah. need some time. First CD, uh, first CD cost five thousand dollars. Yes. And then it sold seven million. We had to borrow that. You had to borrow the five thousand when yeah. you guys were starting out. Well, see, I, I actually, this is a, this is a funny story. I was trying to raise money for the CD. Yeah. So we could, we could get it done. Yeah. And uh, I thought that I would join this multi-level marketing company and use the five thousand, the original. We had, we had saved up like two grand. Yeah. So I bought all this stuff and, and spent all the band's money and so we ended up having to borrow five grand from Wow, wow, so, look what happened. <laughs> I was trying to be an entrepreneur. Right. <laughs> uh, there was a newspaper story that there was a fight at a club. Is that? You know, Mark's been seen places. A guy got arrested for impersonating Mark one time. Um, what do you mean impersonating? actually impersonating him picking up a female and <laughs> that kind of thing yeah uh so i think that's one of those stories yeah so this is didn't happen didn't happen didn't, didn't happen, happen. Yeah, wasn't, yeah. Me, wasn't me uh, uh <laughs> here's another here's... <laughs> wasn't me <laughs> another fun one here's a quote this is your quote uh no. what all right tell me if go this ahead, is true go ahead, go ahead. I see a lot of breasts when I'm singing, but that's not what I'm into. <laughs> Number of ways to take that. Um, I didn't say that. Okay. Do um, you want me to expand on that? Yeah. I, mean, bit? Uh, I do see a lot. They, 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 well, while you're performing up there, yes. it's, it's this. Yes, and sometimes I forget lyrics. <laughs> um... <laughs> Um, Why can't they do that during the monologue? Why can't they do that during the monologue? Um, sometimes they want to be signed. I, I, off limits there. Right. Makes me feel uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but um, I'm definitely into that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, that's right, that's right. Is Creed, now some people, is Creed a Christian band? Or that was a misconception that started off Back in 97, when My Own Prison came out, I dealt 
in probably three or four songs with my upbringing and uh -huh. coming to grips with what my beliefs were, my spiritual beliefs were. Right. And, uh, and when I was a kid, my dad made me write the Bible for punishment. And uh, real strong Christian family. Right, right. All right. And not only did I have to write it, I had to write a commentary. And then he'd, che he'd check it for spelling and grammar. Right. So he was, he was strict. Strict, yes, yeah. yes. And uh, I think with all that, you know, church and yeah. writing the Bible and stuff, I think when I make analogies sometimes, and when, you, you know, when, I, when I'm writing, I think sometimes that comes out. It's not sure. intentional. We right. have no agenda. And the other guys come from different backgrounds, and they didn't even know. I mean, at first, when we got that, you know, people were saying they're a Christian band. Those guys got mad at me. Right. Mike and Scott and Brian, they were like, we didn't join a Christian band. We want to be rock stars. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So. Well, as long as the girls were flashing the breasts, we're okay. It doesn't, you're doing something right. I guess. So the CD comes out later this year. Later this year. A solo album. Um, I'm working with... Uh, I'm working with uh, Seven Aurelius. He is a, he did a Shantae's record. Yeah. He did Ja Rule, Jay-Z, J-Lo. And I'm trying to reinvent the wheel a little bit. So you're going to do a little rap? You no, little rap? no, 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 no. I'm not a rapper. It's, it's, it's more like Led Zeppelin meets the doors with something that makes your 15s kick in the back. <laughs> so. Will you come back and perform when it comes definitely. out? Definitely. All right, definitely. Back. Nice meeting you, man. Thank you so much. Thank you, nice sir. Scott Stapp, we'll be right back.